hello everyone i hope you all are doing good welcome back to my channel let's make some magic cake for today's recipe I will be starting this recipe by prepping my achike. I'm going to use the dry one, you know, the one in the box. So all I have to do here is to clean it really quick and then add some water and we're gonna set this aside. I actually did let mine sit in the freezer, you know, instead of just outside there. It will give a better texture to your achike. For the fish, I went in with macro fish. This one here, we're going to air fry it instead of frying as I did on my previous video. It's already cleaned. We're just going to season this really quick with some fish seasoning and vegetable oil. As for the temperature settings, I did uh, 370 degrees Fahrenheit for 30 minutes to start. Onto the vegetables, we have here some tomatoes, one sweet mini pepper, onions, and the habanero pepper. But first, let's clean them, and then we're going to blend them to make our tomato slash uh, hot sauce. Adding some minced garlic, seasoning, we have salt, black pepper, chicken bouillon, and don't forget the vegetable oil. Next onto the vegetables, you know the ones that will go on top of the chicken. cake. So tomatoes habanero pepper, preferably the green one, and then the onions. You can add some cucumbers as well if you want to. i just skip that one for this recipe. So this is how the fish is looking so far after the 30 minutes. I'm going to let it air fry again for 10 more minutes, then reduce the temperature setting down to 350 or maybe 330 degrees Fahrenheit and air fry it for 20 minutes. As you noticed already, I started working on the pepper sauce. So I'm going to cook these onions here really quick over medium high heat. Then we can just pour in the blended vegetables. I'm just adding a little bit of tomato paste for some coloring. So stir this well and allow it to cook. You can reduce the heat as well, maybe medium low heat to allow the sauce to cook through. As for the chicken, this is how it's looking. All we have to do now is to put in the microwave to cook for two minutes. Our sauce is also done. We have the oil that came out on the surface and uh, the seasoning is good as well on my end. You can check yours as well at this time and adjust if needed. Circling back to the fish, this one is done as well. This is how it's looking nice and crispy. 
quick and easy you have your hjk no need to fry anything on here just cooking your sauce and that's it If you enjoyed watching today's recipe, please give a thumbs up, subscribe if you haven't done so, and uh, hit that bell notification to be notified whenever I upload a recipe on my channel. Don't forget to comment as well. I forgot. All the ingredients used are listed down as usual in the description box. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you all on my next one. Take care.